I want you to try and hold your butterfly like this. You're going to try and hold all four wings a little bit further back away from the body so that we have room to put the clip on. Go ahead and get your clip. You're going to stay away from the body. You see where the body and the wings meet and how it's open here. We don't want to close this because it could break the wings. So we're going to come back a little bit further. Using the clip, you want to catch all four wings. Notice I barely have the lower wing, but it's just enough to immobilize the butterfly. See? It's just barely on there. Okay, once you do that, you can go ahead and lay your butterfly down. This will not hurt them. Now I'm putting them on parchment paper, but you want to try and put them on a smooth surface. This way here, their legs cannot uh, grab hold of the surface and try and move around and this could break the wings. Okay, and we're going to move on to the next step. Next we're going to remove our clear label. Now I'm just going to leave it stuck to my fingernail. This will make it easy to work with. Pick up your butterfly and turn it upside down. You want to hold your clip with two fingers and then with the other two fingers, your index and your middle finger, kind of hold the bottom of the wings and pushing the body out. This will make it very easy for you to get your uh, OE sample. Take your sticker, you're going to just tap the body with it just gently pushing on the body. Doesn't hurt the butterfly. And you can see there are scales on the sample. So we're going to take the butterfly now, leave it in the clip, and place it back down. Now that we have our sample, we're going to do the next step. We're going to take our sample and our index card. You can see I have already put one of the samples that I've done earlier on here. So I'm going to take this sample, put it right next to it, and just smooth it out. The next thing we're going to do is document whether it's a male or a female. This one happens to be a male. There is a scent gland that I can see right here. So on the card, I'm going to put an M. And for the tag number, I'm going to put 0, 2, A. That will be the tag number that will go on this butterfly. This is your data sheet. Everyone gets one of these with their kit. At the top, you're going to put your name here. Here, we want everyone to put, if you're raising the butterfly, what type of milkweed if you're not raising the butterfly and you're doing wild caught butterflies, then just put none in this space. And then under the place where it says zone, you're just going to put your zip code. Now before you tag the butterfly, you're going to put all your information in on your data sheet. So we'll put the date. Put today's date. Male or female, we have a male. 
tag number zero two A. OE tested. Y. Yes. Raised. No. Wild. Yes. And the butterfly's condition is in good condition. Now we're ready to tag the butterfly. Okay, now we're ready to tag our butterfly. So we're going to take a toothpick and just on the very edge here, I'm going to lift the tag up. I press it into the toothpick and then peel it off. Now, we want to place the tag above the scent gland. And I'm going to do it in this direction. Holding the hair clip, this will keep the butterfly still. I'm going to place the tag here, roll it off the toothpick. Make sure I got the scent gland visible. Yes. Okay. Now, you can lift your butterfly up at this point here. I like to take the clip off. So this way here makes it a little easier. You're going to press your tag. I count to 10. Now I'm just squeezing just gently. And there you go. Your tag is on. Okay. Now your butterfly is ready to be released.